Many have criticized me for the way that I spend my money and I don't blame you. I know I'm not the best with finances. The 80 days that I daily vlogged and documented my finances was probably the time where I've made the most in my life. So what do you expect when somebody makes $6,000 for the first time? In my case, I did not save anything. I actually spent on way too much junk food. Horrible for my health, but as well as for my pockets. Rather than fixing the spending problem, I decided since I'm gonna be spending all of my money already, why not invest it into my clothing brand instead? Got a couple sweaters, got a couple sweats. Most of you guys may know, I gave those away. And it is for the reason that I just want to get my clothing brand's name out there. Same with the shorts. I only got a couple more sizes left. I am probably just going to give those away. Whether that's to the audience, you guys, or to people that I know. These have just been test trials. Once I get the shirts and the hats, those are going to be official drops. So that's going to be different. I'm not going to be giving those out just as easily, you know. I'm definitely going to try to look for Instagram influencers or just people that are going to promote the clothing brand. But I need to focus more on profits now. Got a little sidetracked there, but yeah. After spending a lot of money on junk, I decided to start spending money on my clothing brand. At this point, I paid off a good amount of my debt, but next thing you know, my car breaks down and I'm carless for a while. While I was carless, I did stack up a couple of parking tickets. By a couple, I mean probably six. <laughs> Just because I procrastinated the car that much. That's insane. <laughs> so that's, it is. A, I then got. I then junked my car for three hundred and fifty bucks, basically covering the parking tickets I got, leaving me still carless. At least at this point, I had gotten rid of the burden of just keeping the car. And thankfully, because tags were almost due on that as well. So thank God we got rid of it right before we had to pay to get the tags renewed. I was stuck within two decisions. Go the same route and look for something on offer up again. Or get something off the lot and get something reliable where you're getting the car faxed. Many were telling me I should have gotten a Prius. To each its own, I have looked into a Prius before. In this instinct, I did not even think of a Prius. All that matters is that I'm getting to my job, which is paying this car off, and I have a slight plan B. It's not a plan B, I'm just waiting for it to hit so my initial plan can work. I can go into this a little bit more in the future, but right now I'm trying to figure out when it's gonna be deposited. For my paychecks and paying off my debt, I am already going to be paying $1,363 every single month as a minimum into my debt. Those are basically my bills that go into debt. That is not including rent, obviously, as well as whatever subscription or monthly bill I have to sustain my YouTube channels. As of recently, I've been making well over three thousand dollars every month the goal is with whatever extra money i have to put it into the smallest that i have at least for now to get rid of a couple of bills an example being the apartment debt that me and my cousin have had for a while now since january actually <coughs> that is exact <laughs> that is exactly when collections hit now we are left at $990. By the end of this month, I want that to be completely wiped. First reason is because it takes a hit on our credit every single month. Once we pay it off entirely, it will be wiped as if it never happened. Second reason is because it takes $200 from my paycheck or from our paycheck every single month. Obviously, we can be putting that money into different places. Another debt being the place where we are gonna be putting our money once we pay off some bills. As for my phone bill, the debt that I owe my phone carrier is about to go down because my phone, my iPad, and my Apple Watch that I initially got with T-Mobile are about to be paid off within three months. But with the new phone I got to start live streaming and record clips on, I still have to pay a monthly payment of like $60, which is not bad. It's basically leaving my phone bill where it was at before 
with the other payments i just took on something else it's worth it i honestly so far have been enjoying the phone live streaming wise we should be live streaming more but with the live streams we've had already we've you know learned and experienced a little bit to try to get better at it as well i am going to be focusing on paying off my best buy card other than that there's nothing really else that's going to be taking my money away from paying off the car my mom i am going to be trying to make you know slow payments yeah main thing i'm going to be trying to focus on is starting to eat healthier little less of this because these have started to go up in price motherfucking 7-elevens and not even just 7-elevens but gas stations have been taxing the fuck out of ghosts four bucks for a ghost at a gas station are you fucking kidding me you are crazy like what i saw a 7-eleven every 7-eleven i've gone to it's two for five i saw a 7-eleven with some greedy ass motherfuckers i can see that they added the 50 cents but they literally have two for 550 just because of how much people are fucking buying this shit it's fucking outrageous ghost you need to sponsor us asap like i cannot be keeping ghosts in my budget but i've put too many people on to just not keep repping like fuck do i gotta get a testimony from everybody that i put on and i'm just i'm, I'm being too much it may seem like a lot but i was telling my cousin all we really gotta do is make more money simple as that <laughs> we actually got a message about the retro games today that is something that is going to be on top of the priority as well because that's basically gonna be us trying to save up an emergency fund from scratch we're not really gonna be having our paychecks to our name realistically because bills by the end of this month there will only be four months left in the rest of 2024 now i know being debt free is out of reach for a possibility but realistically i just want to be on my feet again and by again i mean for the first time ever since i graduated high school i haven't been on my feet i've dealt with life's struggles which although most of them were caused by my actions Obviously, you got to learn from your mistakes, take them as lessons, and try to improve. For a long time now, I feel like I've been stagnant. Obviously, you've seen my debt go worse, but I don't think my lifestyle or my life has gotten worse. I feel like I've been more motivated, more determined, more persistent on achieving my goals and my dreams. This year, I've grown this channel to be as big as the first YouTube channel that I've made. And getting two YouTube channels to a thousand subscribers is no mistake. I didn't do that by mistake. It's from the hard work I've been putting in these past couple of years. And I know inevitably I'm going to succeed. So if it means I got to take on a little bit of debt right now to then later on receive the riches I deserve, and the freedom, which realistically all I really want, I do want the financial freedom. I want to be able to not work a nine to five. I'm sick and tired of working construction. My body fucking hurts. I'd rather be playing sports on my other channel, making money than fucking breaking rocks, picking them up and throwing them into a dumbass container. I'm not making this channel to be an example. Don't follow in my footsteps. Don't do anything that I do in my videos. I've always made the decisions I've wanted to make. But sometimes you gotta go through the failures. You gotta go through the struggles because that's what makes a man. I mean, all this to say that I'm 22. Many people commenting advice and all of that are well over my age, which gives me hope that I'm on the right path. I hope to be where some of you guys are at and hopefully exceed that. I do want to be the person people go to as an example, but clearly at the moment, that is not it. I guess I'm just doing this for entertainment purposes. <laughs> I'm documenting my failures for your guys' entertainment, and I know you guys love to feed off of it. I just wonder what's gonna happen once I start succeeding. <laughs> If you guys want to keep up with me every single day within shorts, make sure to become a member on the YouTube channel. The reason I'm doing the membership route instead of just uploading shorts on my channel is because one, I don't want the same thing that happens on my YouTube comments to happen in my YouTube shorts comments. And it's worse because... It's worse because with the shorts, you're dealing with people with short retention span that probably don't know what they're talking about. 
So I'd rather the people watching my shorts, watching my daily videos, be the people that truly support me and want me to succeed. All the money that you guys put into memberships will be going into debt. But first, we're going to save up, accumulate a good amount of money from that so we can make a big chunk payment into one of my debts. My first goal is to get 10 members. Can 10 of you guys help me out within my journey? and pay five dollars to see me every single day i honestly don't see anybody paying to see me uh, upload shorts every single day but i'm still gonna make the promise to myself and to you guys that whether i have zero members or a hundred members i'm still gonna be uploading the shorts every single day so whether you join right now or you join a month from now you'll be able to see the content from day one so maybe as the days go by and i start showing you guys that i've been consistent with them you'll join then so be it but i feel like that gives me a reason to do daily uploads or to consistently update you guys with my finances i currently have $34,221 in debt. Let's pay off 5,000 so we could get a little under 30,000. Then we're talking. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace.